the American Institute of Indian Studies and Ansley Jones presents The Jukebox Movement, From Surviving to Thriving. Hello, my name is Ansley Jones and I'm the founder of The Jukebox Movement, a hip-hop feminist organization based in Augusta, Georgia. The Jukebox Movement seeks to empower underprivileged communities to address gender-based violence and oppression through the medium of hip-hop culture and artistic expression. Next year, we want to work with our Indian partners to create an ongoing collaboration with the Jukebox Movement, together with a team of passionate social activists, artists, educators, and cultural ambassadors from the U.S. and India. I will travel to five cities across India to rally the global hip-hop community to explore the creative and dynamic uses of hip-hop culture to raise awareness about sexual assault and gender-based violence. To carry our project to maximum fruition, we need your help to send our group of artists and activists to India. While we anticipate receiving partial funding from other grants, we are asking our Kickstarter supporters to help raise $25,000. Your donations will help cover travel and lodging expenses and sponsor a series of events across five cities. We will collaborate with nonprofit organizations, hip hop artists, and social activists to offer programs to survivors of gender based violence and the surrounding community. In each city, we will hold a week-long series of workshops, lectures, presentations, performances, trainings, and benefit concerts. In Kolkata, we will offer the Survivor's Keeper program, an 11-week program that involves the hip-hop community and the healing of rape survivors by providing certified training to become rape crisis victim advocates. Our partner organizations in India include New Light, Saving Lives Through Dance, Buoyant Performing Arts, and the hip-hop community of Big Bong Theory Forum, to name a few. The American Institute of Indian Studies, or AIIS, will be awarding me a Performing Arts Fellowship for our project. AIIS will provide logistical and administrative support and will be pursuing additional funding to make this project even more successful. In India, I will be joined by U.S. Space Team members Dr. Frank Gunderson, a specialist in human rights and ethnomusicology, Neil Agarwal, a world music multi-percussionist, and Fatima White, an interdisciplinary artist, educator, and expressive arts therapist. My India-based team includes Rimmel Barji, a.k.a. Rimsey, a b-girl and graffiti artist based in Kolkata and Malabika Brahma and Sanjay Kayapa, members of the critically acclaimed Bengali Bao fusion band Brahma Kayapa. We will conclude this project with a subsequent tour in the U.S., a compilation album, and a feature-length documentary film. I was first able to share my movement in India through the U.S. State Department Next Level Exchange Program in 2014. I worked with high school students in Patna, Bihar to create TV and radio PSAs on gender equality and street harassment. I am also someone's daughter. I am also someone's sister. I am also a woman, like the goddess whom you worship. She's someone's sister. She's someone's daughter. I have worked extensively with disadvantaged youth and rape and domestic violence survivors for the past 10 years. My aim is that future generations, in particular young girls and women, may benefit from the positive power of hip-hop as I did. As a five-time rape survivor myself, I have gained first-hand insights about conflict resolution strategies for victims of trauma, and I will continue to teach these skills to communities through the jukebox movement in India. This project will be a catalyst for change to eliminate gender discrimination and rape culture in our collective artistic tradition and create sustainable spaces to help us all move from surviving to thriving. Thank you for supporting the jukebox movement in India.